what's up you guys Prince Mate here Assalamualaikum semua orang How's everybody doing today? Okay um, I, I don't know um, Hari ni punya video you guys Benda-benda yang tengah happening right now If you guys yang don't know kan Hari tu fikir nak pergi duduk hotel I tak boleh biarkan rumah ni kosong I tak boleh just I walk out I punya kucing nanti kan tak makan So I can't just Ciao again. So selama beberapa hari ni guys, I have a few guests yang datang rumah. Eh hey, orang nak pergi kerja je lagi. Okay. Show is here. Ah, I know you have work later. We were here hari tu kan? Okay. Orang macam tengah jalan ke, macam tengah hentak ini kan? The thing is, it's upstairs. Aku boleh dengar sebelah aku show masalahnya. Aku pusing and there's no monkey. Rasa itu perasaan je lah It's not perasaan Perasaan Sebab kalau Come with me I'm so sorry I gotta be honest with you guys I Just Having show here Aku rasa macam lega gila Aku boleh menafas Now Aku boleh you know It's like Aku kalau nak berlakon Okay guys aku pergi TV3 Alright So aku pun pandai berlakon lah You are the best actor So <laughs> Kalau siapa-siapa yang follow my vlogs Daripada dulu you guys akan faham Shul ni macam mana Masih tengah serabut ke ke whatever Shul is always there That is the good part lah you know pasal dia Aku lepas maghrib je Aku memang letak naik atas lah serius Alright Alright Shul sure. Aku pergi bawa dia sampai tingkat 3 Aku dah kau ustaz tu dulu Dia nombor isi Oh Saya dekat faham It's hijau And it's brown it's hijau and it's brown Yang paling banyak gila bunyi Kat bilik tu A few days ago you guys, I pergi keluar dengan Noah Dia ada main-main tau Dengan benda ni, dia pergi letak dekat sini Kalau siapa-siapa jari member Noah, dia budak kecil lagi Bising gila tu After kita makan lunch, ada nak lepak Tak sebab dia nak main game semua and all the stuff kan Dia tengah duduk kat sini Masa dia tengah main this game He keeps on pusing banyak kali tau you guys dia pusing belakang dia main game dia pusing like again and again and again dia letak controller bawah lepas tu dia pergi lari naik atas he ran all the way sampai tingkat 3 aku dah mula macam paranoid gila you guys aku nampak running upstairs without saying anything at all I jumpa dia dekat dalam bilik dekat tingkat 3 So this is where ada benda yang suddenly happen I don't know what happen I tak nampak what happen You like this room? Yes Masa dia tengah lari-lari tu you guys Masa dia tengah jalan-jalan Dia tiba-tiba dia, dia menangis Dia menangis Lepas tu Dia Dia nak balik I tanya dia Eh Apa asal tu? Dia, dia tak cakap apa-apa He keep saying I want to go home Aku nak balik rumah And then I tak nak go to Uncle Mid punya house Again I tanya dia Apa benda yang you nampak? What you do? Apa benda yang you buat ke, you nampak ke? It's like what happened? Lepas tu, bila ayah dia bawa him in the car Dia dah stop nangis Dia dah suka datang sini, you know Lepas tu, dia suka main yang punya PS5 I punya toys semua and all that stuff kan Lepas tu, dia, dia tak nak come here ever again Itu memang sumpah it, Aku punya hati memang berkecah gila um, You have no idea I was so speechless Aku tak tahu nak buat apa I was so upset, I was sad, aku aku solat. Lepas tu I just I 
I don't know what to do. You like this room? Yes. Siapa-siapa yang remember you guys? Um, I pernah pergi Mimalan dulu. Pernah pergi Mimalan once. I brought a friend yang bernama AO. He came by to the house. Baju Ed Hardy tu. Oh my god. Oh. Duh, ni mesti macam I don't know 800. No. Apa tu? 30. <laughs> Masa dia dekat sini guys. Dia, dia nak naik. Dia nak naik atas. Tapi sebelum tu, he told me something. And I can't stop thinking about it. He said that ada benda ni macam it can follow engkau everywhere you go okay is that really true Berber? you see what is that noise you <sighs> kau dengar betul tak you dengar betul tak guys okay sumpah as from upstairs you see every ustaz ni dia kata benda ni dia bukan dia pasal rumah ke bukan pasal tapak rumah ke it's you yep kau buang benda tu kat kat karak is it yes ha, kau buang benda tu tapi bagi pendapat aku cara tu dah salah dah kau tak patut dia buang benda tu dia kalau ada macam ada cara dia kau kena tanam ke dan dan panggil ustaz ke untuk baca doa doa untuk benda tu supaya tak ikut kau sebab based on pengetahuan aku kau buat benda tu benda tu dah marah kat kau benda-benda yang dia cakap tu semua it's 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 probably uh, it's it's probably true oh, oh my god you scaring me apa dia kau nak percaya ke tak tu pulang sebab benda tu buruk sebab mungkin betul mungkin tidak benda ni based yang aku punya pengetahuan lah Sarah stop it please come down no 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 eh hey. this is real life this is real life <coughs> I don't wanna A few nights, you guys. As sebelum A O datang, I call Ustaz Shafiq. Can you come tak malam ni? On the 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 day dia juga. Aku nak hello. Be my guest. A O nak datang. Ada betul malam ni. Ustaz nak datang. Aku punya brain, you guys. I was so lost. Aku memang kelangkap buat gila. I was all over the place. Aku punya brain. I was a mess. Selama 2-3 hari ni, you guys. Aku tidur kat sini. Yes. Tapi seriously, in my head, I was a mess. Paranoid dah betul tak apa Sebab dia They can Yep Haa dia boleh Aduh Dia boleh detect Yelah dia punya sense Dia lagi tajam pada kita So dia boleh rasa pada semua Aku harap Ustaz tu Buat yang terbaik lah untuk kau Kau pun Dah tak berapa orang dah aku tengok Kau lapar ke? AO baru belikan setiap lah makanan It's this big bag just for her Yeah. Is this huge bag? You have free food now. Banyak gila om. Oh, you see happy gila. Yes, she is. She's very happy. Tengok tu. Alright. A few nights ago, I tengah lepak dekat bawah. I was here macam biasa. I tak pergi luar rumah. I tak pergi bilik tu ke. I tak pergi mana mana. I'm always in this area. Aku tidur sini. Aku makan sini. Just everything that I do, it's in one spot tau sekarang ni it was late at night aku post benda ni on my instagram this cat dia pergi lari naik atas she ran upstairs because she heard something and yes aku pun heard something and yes i got this on camera
I boleh dengar Stella macam dia tengah marah It's like she was angry Macam dia tengah bergaduh dengan benda tu I don't even know I goyangkan dia punya makanan you guys Dia masih tak turun bawah Stella Eh Lepas tu lepas she's already here you guys dengan I Hey What was that? Apa you buat atas? Hey I masih boleh dengar something upstairs I can hear satu voice I boleh dengar satu suara dekat atas And it was not a human punya voice Ini memang aku tak pernah dengar bunyi ni Demi Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala I swear to God It was late at night And yes, dia bukan suara manusia Aku tahu suara manusia macam mana Ini, this is not a human punya voice Oh my God, aku nak menangis right now After Stella dah dekat bawah you guys Macam dia mula lari underneath the sofa bed Aku sentuh kepala dia you know, Lepas tu dia mula terkejut Aku sentuh dia Lepas tu dia mula terkejut And then I biarkan dia lama-lama you know, Lepas tu She's fine after that lah you know? But I Dengar suara Coming daripada atas It was loud and it was so clear Yes, aku memang Aku dengar suara dekat tingkat tiga I selalu dengar budak-budak kecil semua They can see things They can hear things I pun selalu dengar kucing, anjing ke ke whatever Most of the, the the people yang I know you guys Most of them see me kan Diorang suka cakap benda-benda yang sama Aku nampak lain Aku nampak macam pucat Aku punya muka macam dah tukar I don't look the same Kau pun dah tak rupa orang dah aku tengok Everything is evolving Semua benda it's evolving And I'm not happy Aku tak happy Aku duduk dekat rumah macam ni seorang you guys And yes, I'm not happy langsung I'm a loner And I've always been Aku tinggal seorang At a very very young age Aku dah mula tinggal seorang Since I was 18 19 Aku dah mula tinggal seorang I'm in my 20s And and aku masih tinggal seorang I keep seeing things And I keep he I hearing things Yang Ustaz tu kata If you dengar You kena mengucap Ayat kursi Al-Baqarah And I did everything On that night After A.O. dah cao Show came over To film Lepas tu Ustaz tu datang To have a look around the house First of all you guys I kena minta maaf Because Masa Shul kat sini He film Dia tak on microphone He did not turn on the microphone Kelang kabut masa tu macam dia nak cepat ke apa Lepas tu the camera is on But there's no audio Sebab dia tak on the, the microphone punya 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 tu dekat atas He did not turn it on Start tu datang There's no audio Lepas tu dia, dia minta maaf semua and all that stuff So um, Ustaz ni datang Lepas tu dia, dia pergi kat dapur Dia pergi kat dapur semua Lepas tu dia, dia tengok-tengok all around the kitchen Lepas tu dia, dia pergi masuk In this room In that room Lepas tu dia dah beritahu I Baguslah. Yeah. lah Tiap-tiap kali Malam ke apa kan Pasanglah surah Pasang je I just Any surah Just Leave it on mm. Kalau masa tengah tidur ke apa You pasang ke benda tu Sampai ke pagi Lepas tu Dia naik atas So mula-mula he, he went into I punya bilik Aku dah boleh tengok muka dia dah macam lain macam I boleh nampak The look on his face He can feel something Around I can feel The benda is in I punya bedroom With me Shul 
And that ustaz I swear to god I can feel something Around kita tau masa tu Dia pergi masuk into I punya toilet Dia tengah pakai topeng kan you guys It's like I boleh tengok muka dia lah You know because I sebelah dia kan I boleh tengok muka dia It's not what I was expecting Aku punya hati memang jatuh gila masa tu Because I know It's It's not good news Even AO pun cakap dekat I have not seen him in years Tak nampak macam manusia lagi I don't know, that's what he said, you know Dah tak berapa orang dah aku tengok Lepas tu, Ustaz Shafiq dia ke tingkat 3 I mula cakap dekat dia, I dengar bunyi In this room coming from the, the bathroom especially from the bathroom and in this room activity yang paling banyak I hear is on this floor ada banyak gila bunyi you guys it's from tingkat 3 dia mula tanya I baru-baru ni ada bunyi ke apa benda ni semua I said yes I'm so lost tu korang aku dekat sini every day I don't leave the house aku tak tahu nak pergi mana aku tak ada rumah lain this is my house I don't go anywhere else Aku tak boleh tinggalkan Stella kat sini seorang I cannot leave her alone He saw that thing on the wall I bagi tahu dia and I explain Ni dulu ada dekat my old apartment Now dia ada dekat sini juga Every second you guys Ustaz tu dia tengok Benda tu you guys I swear to God Demi Allah Air mata Coming down his eyes I actually saw tears Coming down dia punya face Aku punya hati memang dah jatuh gila masa tu you guys Aku pun rasa macam nak menangis masa tu But I didn't I actually nampak air mata roll down Mata Ustaz Shafiq All this right now Ustaz ni menangis semua depan aku It's not real Aku tengah mimpi I sampai macam tu tau you guys It's like I Aku macam No, 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 no though This is not real I can feel macam Aku punya roh ni guys Macam Aku tengah tengok It's like a Out of body punya experience tau It's like Aku tengah tengok All this It's like A mimpi tau It's real Tapi I was so I was so far away Aku dekat sana masa tu But I was so far away Aku boleh tengok semua benda ni For 5 saat ke macam tu tau you guys I was so lost Aku I was so lost After kita dah dekat bawah tu you guys He told me something yang Aku tak percaya The moment He masuk in his house Dia dah nampak benda tu dah The moment dia masuk I punya pintu rumah Dia kata Dia dah nampak benda tu dah I tanya benda tu dekat mana Dia Tak nak cakap Ya Allah itu aku Aku punya goosebumps right now though, you guys. I swear to God though, Aku tak pernah macam ni Aku Aku tak pernah experience anything like this in my life And semua benda bermula semenjak aku buka that stupid box Aku tak sepatutnya beli Aku tak sepatutnya beli that stupid box you guys It's my mistake Itu sumpah It's all me I admit it Aku fikir benda tu semua memang tak betul Aku fikir benda tu fake It's 100% real And demi Allah Now it's affecting aku punya life and soul Everywhere I go you guys Aku pindah rumah for a reason Aku bukannya pindah rumah sebab nak show off Oh, oh, oh. I have been through so much in my life you guys Orang semua they call me fake semua you know Aku buat ni semua because aku nak famous Aku nak attention Guys sumpah demi Allah I don't care about being famous This is Malaysia This is not Hollywood Ustaz actually told me something yang I will never ever forget And it makes Aku punya blood Dia cakap Lebih bagus Kalau aku tak buang benda tu Lagi bagus if aku tunjuk dia benda tu Lagi bagus if dia tengok benda tu depan dia So dia boleh bawa pakar-pakar ilmu ni semua Aku tak sebetulnya buang benda tu AO pun cakap benda yang sama Cara tu dah salah dah Kau tak patutnya buang benda tu Dia kalau ada macam tak ada cara dia Kau kena tanam ke 
and then panggil ustaz ke untuk baca doa doa untuk benda tu supaya tak ikut kau ustaz ni told me himself dia cakap dekat ai everything yang i buat you guys semua salah aku tak sepatutnya buang benda tu aku sepatutnya aku letak dia dekat bawah pokok ke somewhere sampai ustaz Shafiq datang aku buang benda tu last year aku patahkan benda tu aku koyakkan benda tu and then aku pergi hutan karak and then aku pergi buang everything dekat dalam hutan dia ambil air botol dia suruh air minum it is the same same activities aku masih dengar bunyi-bunyi all over the house everywhere i go i masih dengar things in this house after show datang after no one datang after eo datang after ustaz dah datang and check the entire place and give me air untuk minum you guys masih ada activities going on around the house kejar aku what what fly what the it's impossible. Aku, aku, abenda tu memang dah lepas. Last year pun dah lepas. I can't do anything about it right now. Show sekali dekat I in order untuk aku hidup sihat and selamat in this house. Aku kena ada that box. Aku kena ada benda tu, aku kena bring that box kat Ustaz. It's not possible for me and Shul untuk pergi balik dekat hutan tu and pergi cari balik everything yang aku dah buang. Look at that, don't go. I dah buang dah benda tu. So how am I supposed to find it? How am I supposed to go there and find semua benda yang aku dah buang? dekat dalam hutan dua lepas tu dengan dusun-dusun ni semua yang dengan daun tinggi ni semua how do you expect me to go balik dekat hutan tu dekat karak for heaven sake aku akan go sana and i will go and find that box yang aku dah buang tahun lepas he keep saying kalau boleh saya kena tengok benda tu lah Ustaz Shafiq dah balik I tengah duduk kat sini I tengah watch AEW lepas tu I actually I got this on camera Oh my god, I don't go. I am living I punya life in fear every day. I fear things that I cannot see. If aku tipu, aku masuk neraka besok juga. I want a future juga. It might not happen, 